he was a child, for example. Child that you can only wish for. His behavior became so strange. His father drew him out of the house. My heart was broken. sacrificed his own dreams. We thought that we had lost him forever, but now our hope is bigger than ever. Dependency is a disease which can happen to every man. It is not related only to bad and unsuccessful people. We have had patients who have achieved a lot of success in their lives, like doctors, lawyers and police officers. Drugs is a thing that does not choose a man. Everyone can turn into a drug addict. I'm 41 years old and I've been using drugs for 25 years now. I checked up many clinics before that this really helped me. This is not the place like the place I was before. I was using drugs for 10 years and I really tried everything back in Italy. This, this treatment here has exceeded my expectations. I never imagined really that it could be so easy. If the patient lives in Serbia, we provide the possibility of consultation where they will come to us and get a free medical examination. For patients from abroad, there is a preliminary part where the patient sends us the information for his case via email. By analysing this information, we respond with the treatment plan and cost of the medical services that would be appropriate for that case. I had so many treatments before, all the way from California to Europe, but this is the best clinic I've ever been. Uh, the doctors are great, the, the food is great, and. Uh, the staff is awesome. When I went to a detox in USA, they had me waiting from nine to 12 weeks. Then I heard about Serbia. They picked me up at the airport and uh, when I got to the facility, their first concern was how I was feeling. As a very important thing, we organize the healing process so that detoxification is painless, where the patient does not suffer pain, when they sleep well and have a good appetite. After detoxification, the patient needs to be relieved from the psychological mental desires of thoughts that go round and round, which always create a need for narcotics. The third phase of the treatment is implantation of the implant, a blockage that does not allow the patient the possibility to return to drugs at all. He is not interested in drugs anymore. People who come to our clinic, first they have to pass drug detoxification. It's a process of eliminating the symptoms of withdrawal, which is quite painful. There are two ways of detoxification. First is a fast detoxification, when uh, we use the methods of fast detoxification with the help of medical sleep. And the second one is substitutional therapy, when we try to replace drugs by opioid containing tablets and trying to reduce dose from high dose, gradually coming down to zero. Oxyven is the latest device which administers oxygen intravenously, which is used for the body's regeneration and rehabilitation. The oxygen is used to detox the body, improve its balance and metabolism, and collect toxins so the organism can process toxins more easily and get them out of the system. Back in Italy, 
I've done two detoxes. But they, they were like torture. You just have to battle for yourself all day. Here it's different. At first, uh, the detoxification went really smoothly. After two days, when I woke up, I felt great. And after that, we went with procedure with Ibogaine. I was a little skeptical about it, and I was looking about it on the internet. So I wanted to see what it is all about. Naltrexone implant it is just uh, naltrexone containing stuff in form of tablets which we introduce on the skin and uh, this tablet works for 6 months or even for 12 months. If there is no contact between heroin molecules and opioid receptors, there is no release of endorphins, just there is no expected reaction of pleasure and the patients lose interest to drugs. Implants are not legal anymore in England, so I had to look up and I found this clinic. I heard about ibogaine treatment and I decided to have it. They put some kind of chip with the, some implant that really doesn't hurt at all. And it keeps you safe for six months. How technically we do it? It takes about maybe five, seven minutes, no more. Skin incision in the low abdominal area, about two centimeters under local anesthesia. It's absolutely painless. And the tablet with just dimensions the size of less than one centimeter, it reduced under the skin and two stitches, which must be removed 10 days after. When I, when I close, close my eyes, I feel like ants are passing through me and uh, I'm floating over the bed where I lie and uh, picture inserts from my past begin to come up. The crying face of my mom, cocaine, my dad, so-called friends. Drugs change the personality by making the person lying, untrustworthy, nervous and aggressive. This cannot be changed with words or tablets only. That's what the special procedures for withdrawal from drug and alcohol addictions are for. This is pathological reflexes, desire to feel pleasure again and again. Just to destroy these reflexes, we use special therapy. It's a combination of medicaments and audiovisual signals. We put the patient in a state of medical sleep, but the sleep is not very deep. On some consciousness level, the patient is able to receive the signals which are directed to destroy these pathological reflexes. After three procedures, the result is stable and then we can support this result with the help of medications and with the help of counseling. We have physical therapy, which we conduct with complete vacuum electrotherapy that stimulates the body, metabolism, blood circulation, reduces muscle spasm, and provides a pleasantness to the patient for abstinence and polyneuropathy symptoms to quickly suppress and become as minimal as possible. There is transcranial magnetic stimulation, which helps the patient to relax and reduce anxiety without the use of medication. We can apply the electrical stimulation through the ganglia of the autonomous nervous system and magnetic stimulation of the head, which leads to balance of the brain waves and the hormonal status of the brain. During the therapy, I felt some small pain, but it was negligible thanks to the team of doctors. You're never alone, even during the night. They were always with me, and when I had withdrawal crisis, I was supportive of medication. So I barely felt the crisis at all. Therapy with xenon gas is the latest revolutionary therapy in the treatment of drug or alcohol addiction. This therapy helps even in cases where previous treatment has failed. Xenon gas is inert and has no side effects to humans, which is why it can be applied to pregnant women. During this treatment, the patient feels relaxation, reduction of muscle tension, satisfaction, and after the treatment, 
the effect remains for several hours. I had so many treatments before, but and this one wasn't easy. I was on a big dose of morphine, and uh, it lasted for 14 days. I, I couldn't feel it much, and it was strange. But I, I can't say anything bad. It, it's worked really every cent. I feel, I feel quite confident. I'm 99% sure that my craving is gone. I did everything what doctor said, and um, I feel great. I'm leaving today, and I'm I'm, I'm happy. I'm, I'm really happy. During the treatment, we engage the family, and we try to include a post-healing part of the treatment, which is necessary to keep the result of the treatment under control and achieve the best possible outcome. I feel great now because my whole outlook of life has changed. It's been just eight days since my detoxification. I really feel great. Anyone who has the same problem as I have right now, look up and call and these people will surely help you. Thank you all. Dr. Vorobiev Clinic is really one of a kind. And if you are hooked on opiums, or any kind of drugs, I would definitely recommend this clinic for you to come. The healing is possible. Dr. Vorobiev Clinic. <laughs>